December 12th will see Tim Hortons Field become the center of the CFL universe. 24,000 fans watching to see who will hoist the 108th Grey Cup. Treated to a real, to a great day, and the energy will be obvious, and the players, as you know, feed off of that energy, and it just makes... It just makes uh, sports better. League Commissioner Randy Ambrosi says the CFL had to make several audibles as provincial restrictions shifted periodically. That means the stadium will not house extra fans along with indoor concerts and large scale events leading up to the game won't be taking place. This as the province announced today that indoor capacity limits could be lifted soon. Ask anyone who runs uh, major concerts and they'll tell you they don't often do them on the back of an envelope uh, with uh, you know with a handful of days to go right they these things to do them well and to do them in a way that brings credit to the organizer and to the city and to the and to the concept you have to have months and months of planning speaking of concerts the last great cup which we'll not talk about in hamilton was in 2019 and it starred country music star keith urban this year's performer, however, has not yet been named. Uh, Hamilton's also great for the music scene as well. I know the halftime show has not been revealed. Can you give a hint? No, uh, <laughs> I, I can. No, I, I'm really, I, I mean, that wouldn't that be fun if I could be the big revealer? And then I can only imagine the, you know, the phone calls and angry letters that I'd be getting from a lot of people that are working behind the scenes to uh, put the finishing touches on that. So no, a nice try. While Commissioner Ambrosi wouldn't name the halftime act, he did name the host of the 2023 Grey Cup, Hamilton, again. As we got closer to the event, we knew we couldn't put on the full show. Mm -hmm. And so the governors uh, decided that it was, it was awarding it to Hamilton in 23 would allow them to fulfill their promise. Season ticket holders from any CFL team will be able to grab their Grey Cup tickets October the 26th.